and welcome back to the channel yeah you're not dreaming it's the other side of life of Millway. it's Kevin well I'm just gonna take you along an adventure today show you what I bought went to Canadian Tire bought a new toy yeah really need it so why don't we go on outside look here's Brody say hi Brody he's not saying too much yeah There it is. That's it. Bought myself a new power washer. So, I figured, hey, everybody can join me, watch me build it, watch me put it to use. Stay tuned. All right, we are going to open this up. And Brody went and hid. I don't know where he went. There you go. Hey, Brody. Hey. You see what Daddy's building? certainly take this up pretty good. So just for everybody knows, this Simonize, they, uh, they supply Canadian Tire with all different types of uh, power washers, electric and gas. This one's gas. I have an electric one. So I already used it couple of times this year. I took it out yesterday to go wash the car and stuff and I discovered a leak. There was a leak in it and I tried to call them today and they are closed because of the things going on. Uh, I've sent them an email. It, it should be covered under warranty. I've only had it for less than a year. It's electric but this one is last year's model. It was on sale. It's a 2200 PSI gas uh, regular $399.99 on sale for $199.99 I thought hey uh, I'll deal with the other one if uh, it, you know whether they fix it or if they totally replace it then I can probably just sell it and get a little bit of money back I won't sell it for any more than what I paid for it last year I bought it on sale last year for uh, $149.99 it was a hundred over a hundred and thirty dollars off because it as well was a previous season model. But hey, anything to save a little bit of buck, uh, buck these days. So, uh, so we're just getting all the good parts out. It's not light, that's for sure.
two perks in the job. So I'm gonna have to do it the good old ups, upside down way. It's actually stuck in here pretty good. Not, uh, not exactly light. <coughs> oh. it's, uh, yeah, it's a nice little, uh, nice little sheet. 2200, 2200 psi. Because some companies, if you do got to ship back things when they're under warranty, uh, like them back in the original boxes or packaging, <clears throat> it's just a lot easier to deal with the company that way. Uh, there has been things in the past before I've had to ship back or take back to the store within a year. And excuse me for one sec, Mr. Brody got the. Uh, Brody got a hold of those wraps. <laughs> Didn't realize. Okay, yeah, so. <coughs> Excuse me. A lot of companies uh, like their things back in the original packaging. They will take things back when they're not, but. Uh, sometimes it's a little bit harder. Harder to do that. Yeah. So. The handle, the hose. <coughs> this here, these are all the, uh, the nozzles. I was reading about this online earlier. So we got. I think it goes red, white, yellow, black. And they each have a different function. in here somewhere just uh oh, maybe i missed it I know I read it earlier online because I downloaded the manual. Oh, there it is. So the spray nozzle, uh, the red, the red one is a thin, powerful stream of water, so it's difficult to breathe stains enough. The yellow is a thin angle, 15 degrees. The large white one's 40 degrees. And the black ones, if you hook up a detergent bottle, there's a, uh, leave a line down here. You can hook up a detergent bottle. Uh, which I probably won't do because I have uh, 
I have a, uh, a, a the salmonized foam uh, spray bottle that you attach to the handle. It's a lot better because it doesn't use as much soap when you're using it, but it has a really nice spray. So. Yeah. So that's pretty well it. Just all the different parts. This is the spray. That's the uh, sprayer. That's the uh, nozzle and that just screws in here. Yeah. So that's it. So uh, bring you back uh, maybe a little bit later when I'm doing some uh, washing the car and washing windows and stuff. Say hi, everybody. Okay. Wanna come see me? Come around this way. Okay.
So they actually send a, that's for the spark plug, and then they send spare O-rings for uh, the quick disconnect down in here, and for the, for the hose. Wow. And then this that little ring here. I had to look up when I got my other one. That's just to clean out the end of the, uh, the nozzle.
that's it. Uh, not much to that. Uh, you know, I gotta add some. Uh, gotta add uh, some oil to it. it seems to be. Yeah, no, I don't think that's. Gotta add some oil. Some gas. Figure out how to start it up and. Uh, Yeah, so I kind of forgot to turn the camera on, wash the car, but the car's washed. Well, you missed the car, I saw the driveway.
Oh, dude, power washer. Had a few more things to do, and I don't know if I'm gonna do them today. Anyways, uh, yeah, either there'll be a little bit more in this video a little bit later. And welcome back. So, told you to be more footy, but it's not a pressure washer. Nope, we are cooking something. We ain't doing nothing. Well, I wouldn't say cooking, baking. Yes, look at that. Oh, I'm baking banana bread. Yep. Muffins. Bread. Muffins. Bread. <laughs> Not muffins. Here, here's the person that's been missing in action from the beginning of this video. I, yeah, he picked the camera up. I've been in the house, you know. It's gorgeous outside though. It's like 71 oh. degrees. Oh, Mr. Brody wants to play, guys. He gives his toy when he wants to go on camera and play. Go to mom. <laughs> okay, you want mama to throw it? Okay. So, yeah, I. Oh, sorry, I'm just playing with the gimbal. <laughs> Trying to get it all sorted out here. Doesn't want to go where I want to go. Get back here. There we go. There we go. Hey. Yeah, nope, I want to go down. There. Oh, look at that. Okay, so, yeah. So, we're just doing a little bit of. A little bit of cooking and uh yeah so i got this out because kelly goes well why don't you get some footage and i thought she was going to stay out in the kitchen with me and visit for a while because we haven't been with each other all day no she's got her butt mm -hmm. in the chair because my little boy wants me to play well it. who cares about the little boy right now you know, uh, one, i tell you it's a hard life to live, right? Okay. Anyways, uh, yeah, there you go. There's all the nice ingredients. Eggs, beater, so that's it. So maybe I'll bring you back later once it's done. Uh, yeah, this is not an episode of Cooking with Kevin, so you're Ooh. not going to sit there and see me cooking it. So anyways, see ya. Okay. Glad I didn't. Again, my husband didn't <laughs> listen to me and I asked for muffins. Oh, uh, wow, wow, wow. It's a good thing it's not cooking with Kevin. Uh, so, well, it sort of turned out. Yeah, uh, the other one's still in the oven. Yeah. But, you know, doesn't really matter. But I know one thing. When I married Mrs. Wright, I just didn't know her first name was always. Yep. <laughs> uh, well, I got the fan going here. There. Do you do? Do 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 do. There. Oh, you say hi to the camera, Mr. Brody. Hey, looking all sad there. Okay, well, it's been a long day. Uh, what time is it? Uh, it's almost 7.30. Nope, quarter to eight. Wow. Yep, yeah, it's quarter to eight. That was about it, my day. Uh, you guys seen the new pressure washer. Uh, I made some banana bread. And you saw a little bit of Kelly. Anyways, uh, stay tuned. Probably next video will be uh, brought to you by Kelly. Anyways, uh, talk to you later. Stay safe and have a good night. Okay, one last video. I don't know if she can hear me because she's in the living room. But she's not going to hear me admit this. This is what happens when you don't listen to your wife. <laughs> it's a disaster. Have a good night.